Friday, April 9th, 2021. Yeah, I'm in Nevada. This is a desert, except for this million year old lake. It's a good thing it's still here. This is a lake used by migratory birds. I think they're all either flying back north or they've already left. I don't see I don't see anything out here. I don't see a duck. I don't see anything. I'm not sure where they are. They might be further. This lake is pretty big. There's going to be another area that I'm going to hike to back there. It's about five miles all the way around, so I'm hoping I get to see something out here other than lizards. Though, you know, nothing, nothing against lizards. But I truly came out here to get away from the hustle and bustle of the city and to see some birds. And so far I've seen nothing. Sorry about the wind noise. So I'm camped out across the lake. I've already walked a mile. There's Highway 93. I really truly didn't realize how busy it was. I think there's a detour for wide load and 18 wheelers off of I-15 going up into Utah. Uh, I don't know if they're still doing construction in the canyon right after, I think it's in Arizona, before you get into Utah. And if there is, that's probably why they're all coming through here. There are some huge cottonwood trees here. And as you can see, they've all started leafing out. Beautiful for the spring. And it looks like they've planted some trees out here. They are, they are growing. And this probably might have been a marsh before we had such a drought and global warming. So now it's just a dry area, unfortunately. More cottonwoods. I'm hoping I can see, I don't know, some deer. I'll take anything. I'll take back what I said about the lizard. I'll take a lizard. <laughs> All right, so this, as you can see, is the southern side of the lake. It's pretty barren, desolate. There is no one walking out here. I'm the only one, which is usually what happens. People don't like to walk. So I get it to myself, and you know what? I'm not complaining. Yeah, this is all really really dry out here. Unbelievably dry. Wow. So is all of this. They have some viewing magnifiers back there that you can just use, but uh, I put, I didn't put my eye up to it and I used it, but I couldn't see much of it. They say there's fish in here. That's what I was reading, but I don't see any. I do see a fishing lure, a bobber out there. Obviously somebody tried to fish here and their line got caught. Yeah. These are old cottonwoods. You can tell these suckers have been here for hundreds of years. Uh, that's huge. Wow. I can definitely see. I've never seen such a big cottonwood tree before. Wow. This is definitely an interesting area. It's, it's beautiful. It's like 60, it's in the low 60s right now with the wind, probably 60 degrees, which is perfect. Perfect weather for being in the sun hiking. I don't know what that is. sure what that is but it's something 
as I walk, I'm getting further and further away from the campground and the road noise, which is really nice. I'll bring you back. There's a sign up here. Looks like the trail veers off to the north. I just scared a whole group of sage grouse and they flew away. There was at least three of them. I'm not sure if they're going to fly off again, so there are definitely birds out here. this goes. Look at that. I believe I'll be heading out into the Davenport Trail. I don't know if it's a loop, so I'm going to have to look at my map. I'm not sure where are these grouse. There are definitely birds out here. They're all flying, so I can't tell what kind of birds they are. I don't know if there's a, a spring out here. What's going on? This is a find. I didn't know this was here. Huh. Looks like they've been burning wood piles out here. Oh, there they are. There they are. There's the grouse that I scared. I don't know if you can catch them. I'm going to zoom in. I don't know if you can see them. They're running. Poor babies. I scared them. So somebody's done a really good job of marking out this trail, of which I'm on by myself. Amazing. No, it's not. It's pretty much the way it goes. I'm always hiking by myself. So at this point, I'm away from the lake. I'm going to take a look at on my All Trails app. It's All right, so, I'm still walking on the west side of the lake. And there's mountains out here and desert. And the lake is obviously on my right. Now, when you look at a map, you notice that there's like a, a dam between one, the north side of the lake and the south side. And I was under the impression that I could continue through this area and get to the very northern part of the lake. But it says the area beyond the sign is closed. All public entry prohibited. I'm not sure why. Probably because somebody owns this land. So, because no... There's no information that I've been able to find that tells you that anywhere. So we're going to continue. We cannot go to the northern part of the lake, which is a shame because it looks beautiful up there. And we are being forced to cut across on this foot trail walkway. Ah, oh well. Now I know why nobody ever talks about hiking the northern part of the lake. It's because you can't go up there. Let's see what's going on here. Yep. Area's closed. Well, that's a shame. That is a shame because this is a beautiful lake. And it's, it's funny how this, this side that's closed is beautiful and blue, but yet this side is all silty, muddy. There's a lot of birds on this side of the lake, way more than we're on the other side. Maybe this is the place to hang out. I'll probably, if there's anything, I'll stop over down there under those cottonwood trees and have myself a little snack because it's almost noon and I haven't eaten anything yet. And there's a lot of birdhouses out here. A lot of them. Yeah, 
We know, we know it's closed. No need to keep rubbing it in. A lot of these bird houses, I guess they're, they're bringing birds into nest. They're helping them out. That's really nice. I'm, I'm just blown away by how dry this entire area is. Maybe it's because it's spring, but the leaves are out on the trees, so these are definitely dead. This is not coming back, whether it's winter or spring. There's a lot of birds out here. There's a lot of birds out here. I just don't, I'm not a birder, so I don't know the names of them. But there's a lot of them. I don't own any binoculars, so I'll just be able to enjoy them from afar. But oh, there's a lot of them, look at that. There's a lot of them. They're beautiful. Oh, there's a lot of birds out here. See, there's nothing on the south side of the lake. They're all up here. Ah, oh, so that's the trick. They're all up here. Look at this. Wow. So I went all the way around. Just for exercise because there really truly wasn't anything except coyote poop. Wow, there's a lot of birds out here. Alright, so this is definitely pretty out here. I can I can attest to the fact that it, it does get very nice on this side. Oh, they're beautiful. Whatever they are, they're beautiful. shoes. Looks like they're making their home in these reeds. That looks like a really great place to nest. Oh wow. Yeah, there's a lot of there's a lot of nesting birds in there. Okay, this is really nice. I've I completely changed my mind. This side of the lake is gorgeous. So, I don't know where they come from. Where they're going now. Oh, look at the dog, look at the dog. Oh, I didn't mean to scare him. Oh, wow. See, this, this side of the lake is just, it's not barren. I mean, there's, there's, oh, wow, there's a lot of coots. A lot of ducks out there. So this is the duck side, <laughs> and this is the bird side. Oh no, there's, there's some ducks. I see them. It's so dark, it's hard to tell where the, where the ducks are because they blend into the waves. He's out there in the middle. This is definitely uh, a good spot. This is a good spot to see some birds. Nice, they're just flying over my head. There's a lot of ducks out there. I don't see any Canadian geese. Looks like there's a little, a little dock out here to fish. I wonder if I can walk out on that. It's probably closed. Closed for COVID. I know the visitor center here is closed. There's signs all before you even get here that it's closed.
There's gnats, lots of gnats. Lots of, yeah, lots of little bugs. I hope there's not gonna be a lot of bugs tonight near my tent on my campsite. Oh, look at him, he's out there. There's birds that are staying in these rocks and ducks. Well, this side of the lake is a thumbs up. Beautiful. This is just unbelievably beautiful. This side, mm, not so much. Oh well.